Okay, there we go. They call her Nana, and she lives to hear them do it. I think they know that I love them. And these kids love Evelyn House. They trust her, and here's why. They feel her kindness, and go. so have a lot of other people. Evelyn has worked with people who were incarcerated and homeless. She did training for foster care parents with DSS, works with HIV patients and addicts. And at the age of 60, she graduated from Springfield College with a degree in human services. And now, at this stage in her life, she is a foster grandmother with the ABCD Senior Corps Foster Grandparent Program at the Transportation Children's Center. Evelyn is one of 182 volunteers that we have, um, but she's special because of how passionate she is about working with the children, giving back to the community, and also about the aging process. Uh, I'm a senior. You don't look it. You're going to ask me my age? I'm not going to do that. I don't care. <laughs> Evelyn. How old are you? 76. Wow, see, that's why, that's why you don't care, <laughs> because you look so great. For and your I'll be age. 77 in a month. When you get, when, oh, I'm not going to say when you get elderly, when you get more matured. I like that word better. I do too. In your age, you know, and you've retired, and you're thinking, well, what am I going to do? There's nothing for me to do. The foster grandparent program, which I'm a part of, it gives the seniors a chance to do something. Let's see, what could that be? Circle. The circle, that's right, that's right. So these kids are obviously getting something from you. Your patience, your kindness. And I'm getting so much from them. I'm getting so much from them. I smile when I know I'm coming in here. Evelyn is actually a great grandmother to her kids' kids, but they live somewhere else. This gives her a chance to take care of kids and keep moving forward. I didn't realize how rewarding it could be. Even though I had my, my child and I had my grandkids and my great-grandkids and all that, but working with other children, actually working with them, is the best thing that I could have done. Because before I did that, you know, after I retired and I didn't know what I was gonna do, you know. And it's kind of lonely when you're like that, you know, when you just, you, you, you just don't know. You get up in the morning, you do the same thing over and over, you take a shower, you brush your teeth, and then you sit, mm. you know. And at a certain time in your life when your friends who you used to be around have passed away and you have nothing. Look, at that. Look what you made, Lillian. They depend on you, they love you, they want you around, you know? And it just makes such a big difference. To me, it does. And I just want everybody, every mature person to do this. To do this or do something. Don't just stay home. You don't have to. Get up and move. If you'd like to volunteer for the Foster Grandparent Program and join Evelyn or donate to help any of the incredible programs that ABCD offers, just log on to bostonabcd.org.